Welcome back to my channel. If you're a fan of beautiful ancient costumes, enchanting fantasy worlds, and heartwarming romance, then you're in for a treat. Today, I'm counting down the 10 best Chinese costume fantasy romance dramas that will transport you to magical realms full of love, adventure, and destiny. Let's dive into these mesmerizing dramas. Starting off at number one is Joy of Life. Joy of Life was released in 2019. This drama has 46 episodes. This series blends historical intrigue with a touch of fantasy. It follows Fan Xian, played by Zhang Ruoyun, who is reborn into a noble family with knowledge of the future. As he navigates court politics, he discovers deep secrets and faces numerous challenges. The romantic subplot between Fan Xian and Lin Wanner, portrayed by Li Qin, adds a beautiful layer to the story. The series is known for its sharp dialogues, engaging plot twists, and a well-crafted blend of history and fantasy. Number two is Eternal Love. Eternal Love, also known as Ten Miles of Peach Blossoms, which aired in 2017 with 58 episodes. The main leads are Yang Mi as Bai Qian and Mark Chow as Ye Hua. This epic tale spans three lifetimes, showcasing their enduring love amidst divine trials and reincarnations. With its stunning visuals and emotional depth, it remains a classic in the fantasy romance genre. Coming in at number three is The Legend of Shenli. It is a 2024 release that features a captivating blend of fantasy and romance. Zhao Liying stars as Shen Li, a powerful war god who falls from the heavens and encounters Chang Yi, played by Lin Gengxin, the human emperor. Their forbidden romance unfolds against a backdrop of divine conflicts and political machinations. The series boasts high quality CGI, impressive costume designs, and an emotionally charged storyline that explores themes of love and destiny. Number four is Lost You Forever. Lost You Forever is a standout drama from 2023, featuring Yang Zi as Xiao Yao, a princess who disguises herself while seeking revenge and love. The story is a poignant mix of romance and self-discovery, with Xiao Yao encountering Kang Xuan, portrayed by Zhang Wanyi, and Tu Shanjing, played by Deng Wei. Their complex relationships and the emotional depth of the narrative make it a must-watch. The drama's beautiful cinematography and compelling performances create a rich and immersive experience. Fifth on the list is Love Between Fairy and Devil. Huh? In Love Between Fairy and Devil, Dylan Wang takes on the role of Dongfang Qingchang, a powerful demon lord, while Esther Yu plays Xiaolan Hua, a delicate fairy. Their love story is both forbidden and tumultuous, set against a richly developed fantasy world. With 36 episodes, this 2022 drama explores themes of destiny, good versus evil, and transformative love. The series is praised for its visual effects, emotional depth, and the strong chemistry between its leads. Number six is Ashes of Love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ashes of Love is a classic in the fantasy romance genre, airing in 2018. Yang Zi stars as Jin Mi, a flower goddess caught in a love triangle between Deng Lun's fire god, Xu Feng, and Luo Yunxi's night god, Run Yu. The 63-episode drama is renowned for its emotional intensity, stunning visuals, an epic storyline that delves into themes of love, sacrifice, and fate. 
Its richly crafted world and dramatic twists will keep you captivated from start to finish. At number seven, we have Till the End of the Moon. 太太姐，虽然累了点，但你得好好活着。嗯、呃，你要是无聊的话，可以找我呀。人要是憋得久了，很容易憋成变态的。One of the hottest releases of 2023 is Till the End of the Moon. Luo Yunxi plays Tan Tai Jin, a demon lord with a dark destiny, while Bai Lu stars as Li Su Su, a cultivator who travels back in time to prevent his destruction. The drama's 40 episodes blend high-stakes fantasy, romance, and intricate character development. The series is noted for its gripping storyline, high production values, and the intense chemistry between its leads. Number eight is Love and Destiny. You 真的无恙。那日你为何擅闯长生海？原野小仙都已经说过了，就是为了躲避那两个天兵的追捕。Love and Destiny features Chang Chen as Ju Chen, a war god, and Nini as Ling Shi, a young maiden whose existence threatens the world. This 60-episode drama from 2019 combines epic battles, divine interventions, and a deeply emotional love story. The series is praised for its beautiful cinematography, moving performances, and the poignant exploration of love and destiny. At number nine is ancient love poetry. 古君上神，青木带后翅之心，日月可见，诚心求取。Ancient love poetry, a visually stunning drama with 49 episodes. Zhou Dongyu stars as Shanggu. A high god, while Shu Kai plays Bai Jui, the god of war. Their love story spans millions of years and explores themes of sacrifice and eternal love. Released in 2021, this drama is known for its epic scale, breathtaking visuals, and the deep emotional connection between its leads. Finally, at number ten, we have Story of Kuning Palace. This house, except for Lian Er, Tang Er, two Ya Huan Zhong Xin Geng Geng, the rest of them are all idiots. 从前没伤心，竟纵得他们背地里如此猖狂。Story of Kuning Palace, a 2024 release that combines political intrigue with romance. Bai Lu stars as Zhang Zuining, a former empress navigating the dangerous waters of palace life, while Zhang Lingqi plays Xiao Zhan, a prince with his own dark past. The 40-episode drama features complex characters, a richly detailed setting, and a gripping storyline that explores themes of power, loyalty. And love. That wraps up our list of the ten best Chinese costume fantasy romance dramas. Which one is your favorite, or do you have another recommendation to add? Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you won't miss any future drama recommendations. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.